here it is. The uh, Telsajet engine. And steam, air, water operated. This is the main chamber, half inch, 0 0.500. And you'll be able to stack these and increase disc capacity. The discs are uh, 95 millimeters, which is the same as the three and a half inch hard drive disc, but you'd be required to make a spacer to fit them on your uh, 5 sixteenths axle, which is, or would be provided there. 608Z bearings, standard. I used a cover for the outside that you could tap to have a back pressure control. This is the uh, bearing in place here. Venting all lines up. This is the outside basically where you'd have the clear cover or you could have it open for venting of the engine and the axle also exits both sides. So a pulley could be attached to one side or you could use the uh, threaded end to attach something else to uh, generate some energy out of this. Now, off valves I'm planning to include gaskets up to 1200 psi. That's my formal business. I have an optional Pelton wheel style rotor times two that you can go in there. And these are 1 8 inch. So they'll actually cup the air that's entering the engine. To be compared against the Telsa flat disc concept of surface uh, traction basically by the steam and air entering. And this is a little bit of an art piece, but this is for some extreme low pressure uh, test to see what kind of torque can be created. The holes actually exit in line with the exhaust on the outside so that all the steam would be focused, or the water in this case, would be focused through the exits and out the sides. Of the engine. This is all 60, 61 aluminum. A couple of pieces of 70, 75. And this kit will be hopefully available in the next month. Thanks for all the encouragement from all the tech guys out there and the full range of patents that I read by Tesla. And this advanced cutting will enable experimenters to start with something affordably, which was his intentions, and be able to generate some kind of motor power out of high pressure steam or fluids, air, etc. And then we always know what to do with our old TV uh, dish, of course. Parabolics for the heating of the steam, perhaps.